Hello and welcome to the level 1 of question and answer series related to human ear. Human ear is one of the most important body part. With the help of this series, you will understand a lot about human ear, the various parts of human ear and the function of human ear. So carefully watch each and every question related to human ear and try to give the answer yourself. But if in case you are unable to answer, we will give you the answer. with all the related information so let's get started level 1 question number 1 what tasks are carried out by ear option a hearing option b maintenance of body balance option c vision option d both a and b The correct answer is option D both A and B. Do you know that the ear serves more than only as a means of hearing? It also helps to keep our bodies in equilibrium. Its primary job is actually maintaining body balance. Without keeping the body in balance, one cannot survive. Question number 2. How many sections are there in the ear? Anatomically speaking, option A, 3. Option B, 2. Option C, 4. Option D, 5. The correct answer is option A, 3. The outer ear, middle ear, and inner ear are the three anatomical divisions of the human ear question number 3 the eardrum separates option a the middle ear from the inner ear option b the external ear from the middle ear option c the external ear from the inner ear option d both a and b The correct answer is option B, the external ear from the middle ear. The tympanic membrane, often known as the eardrum, is a thin membrane in the shape of a cone that separates the middle ear from the external ear. Question number 4. Identify the element unrelated to the middle ear. Option A, stapes. Option B, pinna option c incus option d malleus the correct answer is option b pinna the malleus incus and stapes are three of the tiny bones called ear ossicles that make up the middle ear The pinna and external auditory meatus make up the external ear. Question number 5. Which area of the ear have skin glands that secrete wax and fine hairs? Option A, incus. Option B, external auditory meatus. Option C, malleus. Option D, tympanum. The correct answer is option B, external auditory meatus. External auditory meatus having hair and wax secreting glands in its skin. Question number 6. Identify the correct order of the tympanic membrane's layers from outer to inner. Option A, skin, mucous membrane, connective tissues option b connective tissues skin mucous membrane option c skin connective tissues mucous membrane option d mucous membrane connective tissues skin The 
correct answer is option C, skin, connective tissues, mucous membrane. Tympanic membrane is composed of connective tissues covered with skin outside and with mucous membrane inside. Question number 7. Which part of the ear is responsible for gathering the air vibration that creates sound? Option A. Eardrum. Option B. External auditory canal. Option C. Pinna. Option D. Cochlea. The correct answer is option C. Pinna. The pinna receives sound waves and directs them to the eardrum through external auditory canal. Then the eardrum vibrates in response to the sound waves. Question number 8. Ear ossicles attached to tympanum and oval window respectively are Option A. Malleus and Incus Option B. Malleus and Stapes Option C. Incus and Stapes Option D. Stapes and Incus The correct answer is option B, malleus and stapes. The middle ear has three ear ossicles that are linked together like a chain. The stapes is attached to the oval window of the cochlea and the malleus is attached to the tympanic membrane. Question number 9. What tasks are carried out by the ear ossicles? Option A. Transmission of vibrations to the oval window. Option B. Increasing the efficiency of transmission of sound waves. Option C. Generation of nerve impulse. Option D. Both A and B. The correct answer is option D both A and B. The efficiency of sound waves being transmitted to the inner ear is increased by the ear ossicles in addition to transmitting vibrations. Question number 10. Which of the following structures assists in balancing the pressures on either side of the eardrum? Option A. Eustachian tube. Option B. External auditory canal. Option C. Oval window. Option D. Round window. The correct answer is option A. Eustachian tube. The eustachian tube balances the pressure on either side of the eardrum by connecting the middle ear cavity and the pharynx. So this was the level 1 of question and answer series related to human ear. We hope that you have learned a lot through this video and ready to learn much more with our upcoming videos. So don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We'll meet you again with our next video. If you like these videos, make sure you subscribe, share with a friend and hit the like button.